It's Grimm's Toy Show Transformers Insider Action Review. I am your host, Ebenezer Middlesdorf. And today I'm going to review Transformers Prime Breast Hunters Smokescreen. And look, you can see the breasts. You can kind of see the breasts I drew right on the packaging here. Breast Hunters. Electronic launch included. He's Smokescreen Autobot. We're going to nail the fuck out of this review. We're going to review this shit out of this fucker. This is the Autobot face. Somebody drew shit on it. Smokescreen, electronic launcher, blah, 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 blah. Zoom in here. He's got some type of penis gun sticking off the top of the car here. Let's see. It's robot mode. Now you can see also the dildo weapon can be held in his hand. Transformers Prime. And you can see they all have tits all drawn on them. Well, not Cliff Jumper over there. This is the fuck face out of his plastic case. This is his face. It is encased in some type of rubber sheath here. It's almost like a diaphragm wrapped around his face. And you can see his arms here. He's got a bunch of kibble air. And then see, he's a breast hunter. He's got these golden breasts on his chest. And then these are his legs. And then this is his some type of honeycomb dildo blaster gun that we've seen on the packaging. And these are his legs. And these are his feet. And then we could turn him around here. Turn around, you hunk of crap. We can see he's got wheels here, and this is his back. It's kind of hollow in there. 38 on the doors. Very G1-like. You can see it's all folded over. It's actually kind of well done. If we can get rid of this Beast Hunter bullshit, it might actually be a good toy. Holy crap, did Hasbro actually put out something of quality? Stay tuned! Well, sweet Merlin's monkey shit. Look, this whole rubber piece comes right off, right in the trash. And now he actually looks like a decent Transformer. He looks cool as hell. Just looks like a regular Transformers Prime. Not some type of Breast Wars garbage or whatever he's supposed to be. So now, I like this toy a lot better. What? I, I, this shoots out. Alright, this shoots out of there. So you plug it in there. And then it's supposed to shoot. Let's see. We'll shoot these fucking guys over here. Shoot! It doesn't work. Okay, ready? Take two. It wasn't in strong enough. Doesn't shoot very good. What a waste. I'm trying to transform this thing. Why the hell does it have to be so damn complex? I, I, I got the legs together, that works, but I'm pretty confused on the rest of this here. I'm about to throw it again. There. That's good enough, right? Kind of looks like maybe he was like, you know, a race car and he got into a crash. I mean, you guys didn't really come here to see his car mode anyway, right? You came to see me get all frustrated and throw the thing and break it into a thousand pieces. Ugh! Fuck you! Okay, so after consulting Encyclopedia Britannica over here... Nailed the fuck out of it. Look at this. Car mode. He looks cool as hell. He's like this little race car. Look, he rolls back and forth. He's got wheels. It says number 38 on the door. I like him. He's cool. There's actually, finally, a decent quality deluxe class Transformer from Hasbro. Because the last couple figures they've been making have been shit. But I like this guy. I'm happy now. And you can take his little rifle here and put it on the top. Like so, and then you can put the little rubber, you know, car cover here. They actually call these, like, bras back in the 80s that you put on there. But I think he looks like shit like that. I take this off. God, it's really stuck in there. And then you take this off, because it looks shitty. And now he's back to a cool race car. Nailed it. Thank you for watching, little Grimmies. Don't forget to check out Grimstoyshow.com. And please like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe for more.